There it is. TRX4 K10 High Trail Edition. RC Grunt here. I'm not doing that whole unboxing bullshit. I don't like doing all that pulling it out of the box. Ooh, ah. Uh, it's a bunch of whatever. Here's the radio it came with. Regular Traxxas 2.4 gigahertz TQI. Same thing we've been using for the last few years now. Everybody knows all about them. They got cruise control on them. They got, you know, they unlock them, unlocking the closing diffs and everything like that. Lots of fun. They are lots of fun, actually. I don't know what I'm saying. But, you know, I have had this truck for two weeks. I haven't played with it yet. I still haven't cut the Traxxas connector off of it yet. I use the EC5s and IC5s. IC5s are way more expensive, but the EC5s are cheaper and you can get more for your buck. The IC5 is a Spectrum thing and it's more expensive, but, you know, more expensive is always better. But I bought a whole bunch of the EC5s, so I have a, I got a whole shitload of them in here. Male and female connectors. I got all these for 20 bucks on Amazon. And then I got the brass fittings here. They all came with it too, so I got all my goodies up here. All my good stuff. Turbo horns, wheel nuts. There are all kinds of crap up here. Oh yeah, that's a, that's just a mess. That's actually rift parts because I blew the differential the the day I got it. The rift, and then these are just these are body posts for trail finders and other stuff. But anyway, so there she is. Pretty pretty truck. But like I said, I haven't even cut the connector off of it yet, so I have not even put a battery in the dang thing. But it is a very pretty looking vehicle. And then like, no body mounts. Can't see them. Gonzo. Because they're just like the Bronco. You know what I mean? You get the both of them off here. They're just the little clips on the front. Just like the Bronco. If you have a Bronco, it's just like the Bronco. There's one on each corner. Gotta pop it off. And pull it right off. And bang. You're just like the Bronco. You got your, your body clips. Where your clips mount in there. One on each fender. This These fenders are wider than the Bronco fenders. The Bronco fenders... Let me put this down. The Bronco fenders are like here. Or this wide here. These fenders come out much farther. Way farther out to suit the body. So... You can't put the Bronco body on this and you can't put the K10 body on the Bronco because it just don't, it doesn't fit. But it's cool. It's the exact same thing as the Blazer. Like if you had the Blazer, the Blazer bumps, exact same bumper bumpers that the Blazer had. Um, the wheels, the 2.2 Traxxas tires, and they came with these badass plastic uh, Traxxas wheels that are perfectly capable I've never had a problem with a, tra a factory of Traxxas wheel with the glue-on tires. They always last forever. These came a little different. They have the uh, the differential locker. It's actually it's not functional, but obviously, but just for scale look, looks pretty cool. And that's the rear. Pretty wild. I like it. And so this truck, I guess. I think all it is is just longer links. It's just longer links. It's all it is. It's longer links, and then they extended the wheelbase by pushing everything back. It's just longer links, and it's the same TRX4 with with bigger tires, <laughs> and like it comes with bigger shocks too. Shocks are bigger than your normal TRX4. But yeah, nothing special, nothing fancy. Just like the Bronco has the new body mounts, but this one has the the higher body, higher uh, ground clearance. Same motor, same ESC. Everything's the same. The axles are exactly the same. See, it doesn't fit on my damn stand. <laughs> so it drives me nuts. But the body's pretty cool. It came with these cool. Uh, came with mirrors, door handles. The windows are actually blacked out when you get it. They're painted over with stickers on them, but I, I cleared mine. And uh, I still haven't um, pulled the uh, pulled the mask off this yet either. So. It just kind of sits here. And the kids, 
friends are like, Dad, why do you have that truck and you don't even use it? And I'm like, I don't know. Why do I have all these trucks and I don't even use them? But I love all my trucks. There she is. So easy. One-handed. You can still do it one-handed. Boom. Boom. Yeah, she's in. Yeah. But, yeah, she's beautiful. I thought, oh, how could you not like that? Could you not like that? So... Like all the videos, like and subscribe. Uh, got another couple coming up. I go out, and I just spend all my money on trucks. I got a couple other trucks too. I wanna, you know what? I, I haven't uh, messed around with yet. I got this this thing here too, the uh, RMX 2.0 MST drift car RTR. I haven't even opened it yet, but that would be another uh, unboxing video. That would be fun. And uh. But there it is, the TRX4 High Trail Edition K10. Beautiful truck. Beautiful truck. It also has these uh, the front end light buckets, just like the Blazer. Exactly like the Blazer. I'm pretty sure it's the exact same grill. You got your Chevy, your Chevy symbol, and your uh, licensed Chevy symbol there in the grill. Come on, focus. Anyway. Maybe I won't focus because it's not. Yeah. <laughs> anyway. But yeah, we got light buckets up front. We got light buckets here. We got these are buckets right here for uh, three mils, I think. These are five mils. These are three mils. And then back here, you got two five mils. And then there's one on each side of it. And that's it. Other than that. They're probably going to have the Traxxas kit. And you know there will be another million other kits online coming out for it. Little cheapos. But, you know, the Pro Scale Traxxas kit is probably the best one you can get. And, you know, the only other thing I don't like about this is the fact that you can't put a winch on it. Unless you replace that bumper. And, I don't know. It kind of bothers me because that's a really nice looking bumper. And, I would hate to have to put... A different bumper on it just because I want to put a winch on it. Because because I have an extra Traxxas winch. I have one sitting right here in the box. But I, it won't mount to that bumper. So, I don't know. Well, I guess I can pull this off too. Let's see. Everybody pulls this off like it's some like special, special moment. I don't think it is. But, let's do it together. There we go. Ooh, it is kind of cool though. Oh man, it is some shiny ass paint. I wish all my paint jobs came out looking like that. Not one of them <laughs> ever come out that good. Oh, anyway, oh, oof, this beautiful red. I was gonna get the black, but eh, you know, I decided on the red. Ooh, that's the best part. Oh. <laughs> that's it. That's all of it. Beautiful truck. You know, and I'm really, you know, I served in the Army for, for about six years. And I love the USA. And I love the fact that they put this on here. I wish it would focus. But, uh, you know. My camera sucks. Anyway, you know what it says. Oh. Like and subscribe, YouTube. Thanks for watching. Peace.